If you don't have a table saw, then it's still very easy to make a precise dado using a sliding compound miter saw. But for this to work, it does have to be a sliding miter saw. To make a dado on the miter saw, we need a temporary fence and we need to bring the fence forward. And the reason we need to do that is if you look at the saw blade when you're doing a normal cut, then you'll see it goes below the surface of the insert and the back of the cut goes beyond the fence there. But if we limit the depth of the cut, which we need to do to make a dado, then if you look at the bottom of the cut, then you'll see that it doesn't reach the back of the fence. It doesn't go beyond, so we need to bring the fence forward. Next we'll make a cut through the temporary fence without going all the way through at the bottom. Next we need to set the depth stop and your saw should have one. This one here is mine. I don't take any notice of the increments on there. I mark my workpiece and I pull the saw down into position and lock it in place like that. So I'll do that now. I'm probably making this look difficult, but I'm trying to do it without getting in front of the camera. So I think that's about right there. To make the dado, we could just mark a couple of lines and then cut to those lines by eye, but that won't be very accurate. So the way to do it is with this little tool here, it's called Kerf Maker. I made this one in my last video and I showed how to use it and how they work. So I'm not gonna go into detail here, but if you want to find out more about that, then I'll put a link above. One thing is when I made it, this one is now set for uh, my table saw and I already had one. And now this one is set for my mitre saw, so I have one for each, which is quite handy. So let's make the cut. I'll set this up for this thickness of wood. And make the cut. There we have it. Perfect. So that works perfectly well. It's very easy to set up and it's not a bad option at all. And if you don't have a table saw but you have a sliding compound mitre saw then you can still make dados. So thanks for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did please like and subscribe and I'll see you on the next one.